Hi guys, this is Keisha Rogers, and I wanted to take a few moments today to tell you about the exciting science experiments on board the International Space Station, ISS, which continue to contribute to the improving of the standards of living of human beings on Earth and in space. The International Space Station at 254 miles in the sky traveling 17,130 miles per hour, just welcomed its newest visitor, the SpaceX CRS-23 Cargo Dragon resupply mission. SpaceX Cargo Dragon 23 docked to the International Space Station at 9.30 a.m. Monday morning Central Time. The spacecraft has joined four other craft docked to the International Space Station, including Crew Dragon 2, a uh, crew two, two dragon, Russia's cargo ship Progress 78, Northrop Grumman's Cygnus 16, and Soyuz MS 18. There are currently seven astronauts and cosmonauts on board the International Space Station. The recent SpaceX resupply mission carried to the ISS over 4,800 pounds of supplies, equipment, and science experiments. The crew will continue to stay very busy working on some fascinating science. To highlight some of these science experiments, just flown up on CRS-23, includes research from the Houston Methodist Research Institute, which will test implants designed to deliver medicine remotely. This research can help in the treatment of diseases such as hypertension and rheumatoid arthritis. Another experiment includes building bones with byproducts. This experiment evaluates the effects of microgravity and space radiation on the growth of bone tissues and tests metabolite, metabolites and how they might protect bones during spaceflight. This may also lead to further breakthroughs that could contribute to prevention and treatment of bone loss on Earth. Finally, you have the retinal diagnostic experiment, which tests whether a small light device can capture images of the retinas of astronauts to document progression of vision problems known as space-associated neuroocular syndrome. These are just some of the latest in the many experiments already being done on board the International Space Station. I wanna make sure to tell you to tune in to the larouchepack.com for more information on a upcoming series of classes and discussions coming on the principles of science and the science of physical economy and the importance of technological progress contributing to the improving of productivity of the standards of living of the population. Stay tuned, thanks for joining.